Hey guys, this is George from Georgia One Apple, and on this video, I'm showing you the application called the Unarchiver. So, what this application basically does is um, allow you to open a lot of um, files with different extensions and weird extensions. And um, so, what you're gonna do to download it is um, go to the page I have provided on the description from the video and you're gonna end up with a zip file you're gonna unzip that with your mac and you're gonna have the app so you're gonna copy to your applications folder and here i'm gonna open it up and the app isn't um a big thing it's just the preferences so what it um what it shows right here is um all the extensions that are compatible with the unarchiver so what i recommend you to do is select all um and then extraction you can change these options right here this i recommend you leaving it the way it is and then you can close this up so here for example i have a dot rar file and you can see the icon is the same as the unarchiver so that means that when you open it it's going to open it with the unarchiver so you can um, select open with or um, choose wherever you want or just double click on it and you can see here a little progress bar from the unarchiver and here all the files it's copying to the computer so once this is over it's going to end up with a folder called Windows XP Pro Service Pack 2 image and with all these files inside. Okay guys, so it's about to finish and it automatically opens the folder where it saved it in. So um, I have a, in the options I have set it up to save it in the same location as the, the basic file. And you can see when it opened it, it has these three files. So you might have different files depending on the file you want to archive. So um, I'm going to delete these. And here I have a zip file which you can open with Archive Utility or also with the Unarchiver. So I'm going to open it with the Unarchiver. Um, and you don't um, need to open zip files in the Unarchiver. You can, op you can open them with um, the basic Mac applications and utilities but it's a very good app to open any type of files so it's about to finish and you should end up with a VMware Fusion.dmg like this one and another example I have for you guys is here I don't know if you can see um, it's called these three files um, together form one called VMware Fusion dot zip and I don't know if you can see that it's got dot zip dot zero zero one dot zip dot zero zero two dot zip dot zero zero three so um, normally in your Mac you wouldn't be able to open these three files together but thanks to the unarchiver um, you can join them together so you just have to click on any of the three files so I'm gonna just select the second one and as you can see it automatically went to the VMware Fusion .zip one so it started with the first one even though I clicked the second one okay so it finished um, on archiving these and it joined these three files together on one folder this one so you can see it works perfectly and um, if you do get an error while on archiving um, it's most probably that you'll have a corrupt file and when you try to open the file inside you might um, get errors or it might not work 
so I hope you guys like the app and it's free to download and I'm gonna be posting more videos on how to download VMware Fusion just as I showed you right there um, so right here I'm uploading the files as you can see it's taking a pretty long time so stay tuned for more thank you for watching Whoa, whoa, whoa.